Thank you for subscribing and hit that notification bell. Hi everyone, welcome back. And today I have for you a new e-file from the Medenia company. And this one is the JMD108. This is available on amazon.com. I will have the link in the description box below so you can check it out. This e-file sells for $69.99. And they have free shipping from October 29th through October 31st. Be sure to always look through your instruction manual so you know how to operate your e-file. And let's look at everything that comes with it. First of all, it's a beautiful color. There is three colors to choose from. They give you some sanding bands. This is the cradle to put your hand piece in. And then they also give you some drill bits here and some more sanding bands. Now they give you this cuticle bit here on the left, a mandrel, and then some other kind of stone bits. I think those look a little bit questionable, <laughs> but anyways. And here is your hand piece, and it's a really nice size and a beautiful color. It sort of looks like it's rose gold, and it matches the e-file, the color of the e-file, and I really like that. Now, it's not very heavy at all, and it doesn't feel really big in your hand or anything like that. It has your typical twist and lock to open up and replace the bits. You twist to the left, lock to the right, okay? So, really simple. The bits are the standard 332nd size, and here is the e-file out of the box here. And it has some little holes on the side here where you could put six drill bits there if you want. I measured the e-file for you and it is four and a half inches by four and a half inches. And the cord is about five feet long. And if you wanna read any of the specifications, you can go to that link in the description box and read all about that. I'm going to go ahead and get this all set up for you so that we can hear what it sounds like and see how it operates and works. Now, I have done about four reviews of e-files from the Medenia company, and out of the four, I only passed two. And this is the second one that I passed right here. I really like this one. Now, with this e-file here, what I like is that there's no knobs, no dials, none of that, no buttons. It's all on screen on the top it all lights up and it's by just the touch of a finger. We touch that on and look, this is the speed for your hand piece right here. Uh, and these are the speeds that indicate max or minimum. And this is the reverse right up here, okay? Let me zoom in so you can see. Turn this button on. Okay, there you go. That's your speed, okay? This is forward and reverse here. See the R? Forward, okay? R for reverse, forward for forward, okay? So we're gonna keep it in forward, max and minimum. Let's just make sure that you can see this. On and off, maximum speed, minimum speed, reverse, and this is your speed and it's indicating that it's going forward. I don't really think that's loud at all. And there's there's not that much vibration. You know, really, how often are you going to be going 35 RPMs? That's not going to happen. That's not going to be very often.
So to do cuticle work, I usually do cuticle work at about four, between four and five. Wow, that's still quite, quite fast at three, wow. Hmm. I'd have to put the bit on to actually see. Wow. Okay, let's do reverse, okay, let's go. Okay, we're going to hit the reverse button. Oh, wow. You don't have to, you don't have to switch or hit a button or, or just, you know, turn a switch. It's just a touch of the finger. Give it a second and there it goes. That is amazing. So far, I really like this. And the color combination here is beautiful. It comes in other colors too. Well, let's go ahead and give it a try. All right, so I need to finish taking off this builder gel from my nails. And yes, my nails are a mess. <laughs> Sorry. But anyways, um, but yeah, I will be using my left hand to remove the nails on my right hand, which is not my dominant hand. So be nice because it might look a little awkward when I do this hand. So yeah. All right. So let's turn it back on. Hmm. I guess wherever you left off at is where it's going to turn on at back on. Let's see. Let's try this again. Oh yeah. So it has a memory. All right. There you go. So we're at six. Let's turn the machine off. All right, we'll turn the machine back on and it's still at six, so it does have a memory. All right, that seems like it's so fast. I don't usually go that fast when I do cuticle work. All right, so let's do this. Uh, maybe a little bit faster, three. Oh, we gotta go faster. All right. Nah, I gotta go faster. I think. Hmm. Ah, huh, thing needs to. very smooth and you have to get the right speed I'm not used to it you know some e-files you can go really slow and and it can you know take it but some you have to it's some you have to go faster to, to do it so to do the it seems like it's going it, it it seems like it's going fast, but it's really, once you start filing, it just seems like it's really smooth. Hmm. All right, so I got a lot of gel on this now. So. go really fast kind of and I want to press press down and see if it bogs out on me not really Look at that oh there's some thick gel right here let's go up higher okay this is powerful Wow. Whew. It's very smooth. No vibration in it. Just just works with ease. 
Wow. That's amazing. Hmm. Let's turn it down. All the way down. That really worked, and I didn't even have it up full blast yet. So for me, when I use my left hand, I always go in the reverse. So I need to go in reverse. Look up to 20. Because I always go from the left to the right, usually. And I have to be going in reverse this way. And let's go, let's do something. Let's just go, let's just go to 35. Okay, here we are. Now I am pushing down, and I don't notice any drag, really, nothing. Hmm, wow, nice. Okay, let's do this one. I'll cut that thing right off. Well, I do have a different bit on. Let me change my bit to coarse. All right, so I have the coarse bit on, and I'm gonna turn it on. And it's going to be where I left off at, and that was 35. That is... I'm going dangerously high, everyone. <laughs> Well, that's the end of the video and I think by my demonstration and review I think you can tell that this e-file is a very good one and it's pretty good quality works great it's really fast <laughs> I give this one a passing grade of an A plus now I do want to warn people that are new with e-files this is a very fast e-file and if you have not had e-file training, I would suggest that you take some courses on that and learn how to, you know, operate an e-file properly. Because if not, you can hurt yourself. The link is in the description box if you're interested in purchasing this or reading more about it. Thank you, Medenia. And thank you to the rest of you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.